The ultimate goal of the Douglas County Youth Center Inside Out Mural Project is to educate our students so that they realize an art project can be more than just painting a canvas in a studio. Um, it can involve going out into um, the world and interviewing people you don't know, uh, uh, diving into circumstances that might be slightly uncomfortable. Well, first, for DCYC, we uh, met with several detainees in the program, and then we listened to their stories, asked them questions, and then we took that for inspiration for the mural. We just listened to them, and we just found key words that they seemed to find interesting. Like this one girl said that sometimes it's like being an actress. They come in, they mingle a little bit, they have some scripted questions that they're allowed to ask and from there the conversations might expand. It both gives budding young artists a way to connect something that is meaningful and real through um, this thing that they actually love to do through making stuff, through making art. My mural I guess revolves around the self and how we both are two different people in one. A girl wrote that we are good girls but we just made mistakes. So I thought it was kind of cool to see how you can evolve from one moment to the next. Uh, one of the questions we asked was, if you were Superman and you could do anything with his abilities, what would you do? And this one guy answered that he would carry people on his back and fly them wherever they would want to go in the world. And we asked, well, if you can only carry one person, what are all the other people going to do? And he said they just wait in line. And so mine is a man carrying another person and this long uh, progressive line of people. See, we know like the inside. They actually talk to the kids here to get those ideas for those. So I'm going, hmm, I look at that and go, who was that? That they talked to, that they got that idea from. They get to tell their stories or their, their little anecdotes to somebody who cares. Because when they come in here, they got everybody talking at them mm -hmm. and telling them where they're going to do, how they're going to do it, etc. And this is their chance to express themselves positively and actually get some of that garbage out, if you will, to somebody who might be interested. Ultimately, it hopes to be transformative, I think, to see and talk to um, youth who are very, very much like them without a support network, who are uh, doing things that are not that far afield from what the, the youth at, at Camp Bellows have done, but uh, for one extra bad decision they made, uh, got on the wrong side of the law and it kept getting worse. Well, I'm hoping that this project will um, mature enough so that we can use it as a pilot project and share it with other cities. We come up with a system um, where both the detention center and an organization can communicate successfully and pull these things off. Then I'd like to see it repeated in other cities um, across America. I think it's a valuable opportunity um, and it's generating really interesting artwork.